do what we need to do to help you. I had uh, an overdose on PCP. My family deserted me, my friends deserted me. On uh, December 20th, I you know, tried to end it all. You know, I was, I was drinking. I did a couple years in jail. I was shooting dope. And I ended up in a psych hospital. It's been an ongoing battle. I have a little boy that needs me. And it breaks my heart. I drank heavily for about five years. It takes you to such a dark place. Using some cocaine and smoking marijuana. I was shooting heroin and meth in my neck every day. Pretty much lived a destructive lifestyle for the past 20 years of my life. I began to use heroin. Using the Dilaudid, you know you need more and more and more. Where I've been is not, not me and I want to be me again because I haven't been me for a long time. I said I wouldn't get high at work, and you know, then I'm in trying to find a vein in the bathroom all night. My disease took me, you know, to the dark place. I continued to use, and then came a point where I tried not to use, and I could not stop. I had no mental defense against the needle. I was drinking very heavily. I also sold drugs, too. I stole medication. The disease really had me. I went to sober living after sober living. I was literally going insane. I love her and I want the world for her. I managed to pull myself out of that with the help of Spencer. Um, I feel amazing. I feel like I'm me again. We seek people that we, we want what they have, and I wanted what this person had, and it just amazed me, and that's when it clicked. And so I went and got the help. It's a really incredible feeling. Um, there's nothing that I'm missing. I'm getting a lot more than I ever would. And I needed somebody to tell me that it was going to be okay because I didn't know. I didn't think it was going to be. I can be there for my son. I am a responsible, productive member of society today. I'm very happy. I'm extremely grateful. Extremely grateful for the gift, um, for Spencer Recovery, for my higher power. I have my life back, you know. So there's hope and there's, uh, there's actually um, a reason to live. It's my life again. I have control over it. If you or a loved one is struggling with addiction, please reach out 